Hello there, and welcome back to another free roam episode of Hogwarts Legacy. So to start out today, I wanted to show everybody where one of my favorite quests in the entire game is. Hello, it's Penny the House Elf. Now, it's a really long quest, so we'll save it for another day. But basically, at the end of it, you get your own store where you can sell all the gear that you pick up that you don't need and you get extra money for it so it's definitely worth doing so let's go back to our hard save okay All right. Let's check our hopping pots. I bet those are ready. All right, Aduras. Don't need a Maxima. Could definitely use a Focus Potion though. All right, that's pretty cool. Wish you could have more than three though. Okay, so I was asked earlier about the plant for focus potions and you need to have what's called a, I think it's a large potting plant. And let's see, where is it? Got small, medium, and large. And I don't remember it being very expensive, but you need that for Fluxweed Stem, which is going to be one of your main ingredients for Focus Potions. As you can see, Fluxweed Stem, Lay Swing Flies, and Dug Bog Tongues. Alright. Uh, next thing I want to show is... This is the gear upgrade system. Now we still need to get our unicorn hair. That's what we're going to do right now. And here you can add all the traits that you found. And you just need either Diracal feathers for level 2, Neasel fur for level 3, or uh, Puffskin fur for level 1. And these only slot into purple and these only slot into uh let me see uh legendary legendary yeah that's what it's called you can actually slot any of these into any of the legendaries but only up to two on purple and one on blue and you get this i believe it's through a story quest professor weasley gives it to you so that you talk to Deke in here, and you start capturing all the beasts and stuff, so. Let's go get ourselves a unicorn. Oh, one other thing I want to show real quick. The transmog menu. Now you hover over it and press square. And every type of gear that you picked up for that appearance, you will have in here. You don't have to wear it or anything, you can just have it and then sell it. Not even look at it, except in the sell menu. And these ones are the ones that unlock through challenges. Like, they all look pretty cool. This one's DLC. That looks really cool, actually. Uh, there's that one. And this one is the uh, house chest. got our Elder Wand replica. I think I got it kind of close. Alright. What else? Okay, the talent tree. You are definitely wanna, gonna want to fill out the core first. Because these are like your core gameplay mechanics. So, this is really useful. And so is this. Because this will basically eat a quarter to a half of their health just from a parry and then this 
is really nice. It completely eliminates shields. And these are, of course, useful. The spell knowledge. Uh, these ones, if you like using ancient magic, are useful, but you don't always need to have extra. I mean, you build it up pretty fast if you're dodging and comboing. So, this one's nice, too. And... Further distance for Revelio. Okay, for all the stealth quests, this helps a lot. I uh, saw core. Dark Arts. So this is a curse build. I basically have everything cursed before I kill him. And I get health back for killing a bad guy. This kills all cursed enemies if I get in trouble. Uh, Crucio, or actually all curses, last longer. Crucio Mastery allows me, when I shoot them with basic cast, it flings off curse bolts that curse everybody around. That is like the most OP thing in the game. Because then you can just shoot an Avada Kedavra at them and they all fall down. Uh, I don't use Flipendo much, but yeah, these ones are really fun to have. Especially, uh, sorry, this one. Where a parry also curses. That's just awesome. And then these ones are useful, like Descendo. I'll show that one off a little bit. Alright, oh, and one more thing. So to unlock the cosmetics, you gotta go in here. And this is where you unlock certain uh, traits. I forget to go in here a lot. And also it's where you can unlock a few cool brooms. And more ancient magic. Which I completely missed on my first playthrough somehow. Uh -huh. Those you have to find those ancient magic hotspots. We did one in the last episode. And then Merlin challenges. Haven't really had a need for that. But I'll do those on an episode one day. And you can get cosmetics. Alright, let's finally get into it. It was about seven minutes of preview, but I hope that helps anybody having a little bit of trouble navigating the menus and maybe the talent system. Uh, where are we going? Alright, I think I got Horklump Hollow marked. I do need some new whore clumps. Adventure, are we? Oh, I need to mark it again. That's okay. Oh wait, have I not done it on this save? I swear I did it. Ah, oh, that broom upgrade 3 is nice. I'd also like to show one of the easier ways to get money really quickly. Of course, bandit camps are a great way to get some gear. See, that's that damage on Stupefy and also Curse, so one shot kills them. These guys always have a little bit of money. So, I recommend you do that store quest from Penny the House Elf in Hogsmeade. Because, like I said, you get a little bit more gold for each thing you sell. And it's just a really fun quest. I I had a lot of fun with it. Oh. <laughs> know what? I don't need to bother with you. Oh. Was... Huh. I thought Crucio couldn't actually kill them, but I guess it can. Cool. Because it always stays at like one health. Alright, let's go into Horclump Hollow.
Already been there. Yeah, I think I already got this guy. But we can go down there anyway. See if he's there. Always love a good troll fight. Oh, yes. Uh, what can I use here? Oh, that that's so unfair. I just gotta remember to roll. Got stuck there for a second. Oh, I hit the parry button. And he is dead. Alright, I apologize, that was not my best effort. Seems I've forgotten how to fight trolls. I wonder if he responds. I swear I got him on this playthrough already. Uh, there's got to be a chest down here somewhere. Mm. Perhaps up here. Well, I guess that's it then. Alright, let's grab ourselves a unicorn. Uh, unicorns are over here. Wait, what just happened to him? Uh, did I flip him over by accident? Sorry, little unicorn. Uh, no, we need two. Actually, not really. We don't need two. Let's go get some money real quick. Um, already been there. Coro runes is always fun, but I've already done that one. Feldcroft, already been there. Uh, okay, there's got to be one over here somewhere. Mm. Nothing? No way. Oh. Already been there. Oh. Already been there. Been there too. Phoenix Cave. Um. Oh wait. Ooh, Troll Air could be fun. Oh, Treasure Vault. Duh, that's what I was looking for. They're a lot smaller on the map. Okay, so you can find these like scattered all over. Broaden the mind. 
I realized that it took me a little while to find one, but I swear they are all over. Let's kill some dug bogs. I can show off that Avada Kedavra. Ouch. And that is how we farm dug bogs late game. <laughs> Revelio. Oh, that's just so much fun. It should be illegal, or at the very least, unforgivable. <laughs> Any more? Oh, we killed. Well, there are four. All right, treasure vault time. This is a good place to get whore clumps too. Uh, how do you open? Oh. No. I do like being able to sprint while concealed. This looks intriguing. Uh. No, we not we want that. Nope. Lumos. There we go. Oh, are those spiders? Nope. I do enjoy doing that a lot. Is that it? Little treasure vault, I guess. Huh. All right, let's find one more. Yeah, see, they're all over. And what these are going to be helpful for, like I said, is getting money early game. Right, how do we get in this one? Not quiet enough. Ain't got no time for trolls today. I mean goblins today. Alright, what do we got? Big money. Come on. Nope. Alright, well I guess there's a chest with one piece of gear and all you have to do is run there. <laughs> I'm hoping I'm wrong and I come up on a better one. find one more real quick uh, yeah honestly I think bandit camps are probably gonna be better I mean if you want easy gear without getting one less human to in one trouble out. ow you known you oh lose. that was embarrassing <laughs> Okay, let's try that again. Let's pretend like it didn't happen.
Okay, we're gonna try that again. This time with less failure on my part. Alright, where was that? Right there. Don't even need to mark it. Reminds me of the time I nearly fell out of a car at Green Ah. Oh, come on. I'm stuck? Alright, this is really embarrassing. Ouch. Oh, I see the problem. <laughs> they were a little bit higher level than me. I thought they were just easy little goblins. Alright, what do we got? Expelliarmus. Well, there's got to be some reason to do that, right? No, nope. guess not. Revelio. Okay, and lacewing flies, like I always say, are great to find at night. You don't even have to get off your broom for the most part to get them. Alright, let's clear out another bandit camp so we can make some money. This bandit camp? Nope. Another thing to do when you're flying is just keep throwing out Revelio so that you can see all the enemies and any chests nearby oh and something that actually uses the same plant as um, what was it same plant as focus potion it's flux weed stem and lacewing flies just those two ingredients and now you can see all of the chests so let's go find a chest real quick. There we go. Bandit camp. There's a chest in there. Wonder if I can... Oh wow, that was awesome. Was not expecting that. I am pleasantly surprised though. Yeah, I can do it too. <laughs> Wait, that was a pretty big fall to survive. Why did he just explode? Ouch. No. I don't know why my targeting's all messed up. Am I supposed to be impressed? There we go. She was bugging me. Okay, who's left? Oh, you still? had enough of you. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Alright. 
Now you can see that's a collection chest, so that doesn't count. Those show up anyway. But... I guess this is the worst bandit camp ever. They don't have any treasure. Some lazy bandits, I guess. But yeah, I would definitely recommend getting that potion. I think you start with the recipe. But yeah, it's easy to get. I already went over what kind of pot you need for Fluxweed Stem. Let's curse everyone. Oh man, we got in furious. There we go. What? Oh, that was bad. I am not playing very well today. In my defense, it's a lot going on at once. <laughs> Oh, that's weak. Doesn't actually kill him until you. Wait, did they all just die? Yes, they did. All right. That was a little bit tougher because of the unfairy. I was not expecting I'm glad I had Confringo on instead of Bombarda although I could have just thrown that all right no chess here all right uh, let's see I guess we can go there even though we've already been. Oh wait. Let's check out that cave. Those usually have some good loot. I wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. Wait. I feel like I've already been here. Very. Not very hardy can bring or hardy in fairy. No chest yet, seriously? Oh cool, we got butterflies or moths. Rebellion. Somewhere. Oh yeah, that focus potion definitely hits harder against Inferius. Oh. Can't use my broom. Rebellion. That would make sense, obviously. <laughs> uh, can I even get up? Nope. Alright, there's gotta be a thing. A Leviosa thing. Rebellion. Not in there. Oh. No? That's a chest. But as you can see, it's a small chest icon, so it's a loot chest. 
which only show up on the minimap if you use this potion. Uh, Felix Felicius, which is L1 and X. Let me put my focus potion back on. Where might the butterflies be? Moths. Wait. Oh, see? Perfect example. You got a small chest on the map there, right next to a... Oh. Derp. And as you can see, this is a collection item. Alright, now we know what we need to get that other one. If I could get through this mess. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Alright. There they are. I wonder if you use ancient magic, if it'll always use lightning or fire. It does. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh, you know what? I know what this one is. We've already done this. Oh. It's kind of fun, though. But I can't get back up. Oh, I can't fast travel either. Alright, we gotta leave this place somehow. Uh. Wait. Lumos. Oh, look, we missed a chest back here. Alright, well that's probably the best way to get money early game. You can also do one more thing. Let me show you real quick. So... In Hogsmeade, there's a little shop called Brood and Peck, and you can actually collect animals and sell them for a pretty hefty profit, like 120 gold or more for the rarer animals. Let's sell one of our baby Thestrals. Well, actually, that's mean. We'll see what we can sell. And if you haven't seen already, capturing beasts is relatively easy. So it's a quick, easy way without any combat to make a lot of money real quick. You just capture a whole herd of uh, Diracal or Puff Skins and... What just happened? Ooh, 120. So they all are worth 120. But yeah, if you have them in your bag, you can sell them. And you can also buy just about anything. Not sure about Phoenix Feather, though. No? Nope. I'll not mind seeing you here again. I think you have to do welcome. Deke's quest for that one. All right. What can we do? Let's do... Alright, let's upgrade our gear, finally. That was the mission we were on that I forgot about. Alright. Oh, and I, 
like to have potions already made. Just makes it a little easier. And every time you come into the room of requirement, grab your plants. You probably won't need more than this if you... Uh, actually, let's just put another flux weed out. Why not? Just to show you how real quick. Large potting table. Let's do botanical. Change the color. Make it green. Wait, no. Alright, back to Lumos. Alright, now we got two flux weeds going, and I think the last thing we'll do today is get some fertilizer. See what that does. Mm. This isn't really your area. I'll look after you. No, why do I always shoot the unicorns? Oh, I did that in another video. I'm so sorry. Come back. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Every time. <laughs> okay. Pro tip, don't shoot your unicorns. They don't like it. It was a pretty big environment. Jeez. I wonder if you can get Horklump juice. Oh, is that a collection chest? Unidentified one? Useless. Yeah, okay, this is... I have never gone beyond the uh, entry area, I guess. This is huge. Well, I guess that's where you're limited to. Try not to shoot our unicorn again. We fly? Nah. No. Alright, let's upgrade our stuff. I love that apparate dodge. Alright, oh, and we got some gear to sell. We'll do that, and what else did we want to do? Uh. Really? One moon calf fur? That's what I need? Okay, moon calf. We'll go dump our stuff off at the store. Okay. Just whatever you do, don't Avada Kedavra the unicorn. <laughs> okay, Felix Felicius. As you can see, it's lacewing flies and fluxweed stem. Probably two of the most abundant ingredients in the game that you can find just about anywhere are lacewing flies and fluxweed stem. Well, you just grow it. I'd say focus potions probably have the most effort required into gathering their ingredients. But, it's not too bad. 
throwing out a Crucio and then shooting all those bolts and then after that you just Avada Kedavra and they all fall down. Uh, what do I need? I need Wigan Welds. Well, I don't really need them right now. But I think the last thing we're going to do for this episode is go and fight someone. Oh, already went there. Alright, let's go sell our stuff that we don't need. Oh, and you get to name your store out of three possible names. I like the one with Venom in it. I don't nice know why. You, Just appealed to me. <laughs> it is wonderful to see you back here. Uh, probably be a good idea to get that since I've increased level. So you get 165 versus like 150. Uh, 66 versus 60. Two hundred and twenty instead of two hundred. That's nice. All right. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> I was inside the store and now I'm not. All right. Let's um. Let's see what some potting tables cost. I was wondering when I'd see you again. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, fertilizer. Fertilizer. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. To that's what I wanted to get. All right. You get the dung pile, but I think I'd rather just buy some. Uh, yeah. The Magic Neep. Hello. Be with you in a bit. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Alright, let's see what fertilizer actually does. Could probably be like the greatest thing ever, and I missed out on it all this time. Wait, what? Oh, one more. Yeah, okay, not, not the best thing ever, but I'll take it. All right, got pretty good numbers there. It's my flying mount. Go with the black one for now. Alright, looking for a bandit camp. Small. Actually, maybe we can end it with an infamous foe. Or a troll fight. I think there's some trolls over here. Yes. Always glad to fight a troll. I wonder who lives here. Oh, this might be a good way to see chests. Nope. Looks like I've already looted the town. Revelio. Really? I have to get off? <laughs> it's 
so lazy I just want to ride around on my broom everywhere. That's odd. This one isn't showing up. Oh, money chests don't, I guess. Just gear chests. Come on. Now I'm getting back to it. Didn't actually mean to do that, but there we go. Alright, well that was a fun fight right there, and a great note to end it on. Let's loot the place real quick. Got a loot chest somewhere. Uh, is it inside of the mountain, or is it above me? Let's see if it's above. Nah, it's probably in the mountain. We'll leave it. There's one. Oh wait, no. Yes, that's a chest. Ouch. I can be used for better things than I know. Enjoy suffering, do you? I find the games a lot more fun if you kind of lay off the Avada Kedavras and only use them at the end of a fight or when you get in trouble. I won't rest nah. Let's fight some Ashwinder Dark Wizards. Or poachers. Poachers are technically dark wizards. I hope this isn't the one we just came from. Yes. Oh man. Nope. Don't want goblins. Don't care. <laughs> I said we're fighting Ashwinders. That's the end of it. Um. There's always Ashwinders here. Have I left any bandit camps? Oh, I'm in combat. Now I'm out of combat. I hope. All right. Last thing of the day, we're going to fight some Ashwinders. I swear that thing just... Nah, I'm seeing things, I guess. See if I can grab some leech juice real quick. So yeah, to find leech juice, just fly along the coast. OK, 
cast Revelio. Having that extra range on Revelio is really nice. I do wish there was a hood on the relic robes, but that's okay. Oh, of course, they're not Ashwinders. Oh, this is blowing my mind. Did we kill all the Ashwinders? There's no way. Alright, let's just fight these guys. That's how you have fun with Avada Kedavra. Alright, who's left? Did what now? Oh. Smash him. everybody thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed as much as i enjoyed making it i will catch you on the next one and have a great rest of your weekend